Yo, what's up guys? This is an updated tutorial on how to get your Xbox One controller to work for Red Dead Redemption 2 through your PC purchased through Steam. Because we're going to get there through the big picture mode in Steam. I made a video on this last year. They've updated Steam in the big picture mode since then. I've been getting comments on how do you get it to work. Uh, I re-downloaded Red Dead Redemption 2. Everything still works for me. I didn't have to change anything. So I'm assuming what I did in the previous big picture mode through Steam carried over to the update and it still works. But that being said, we'll just go into, into Steam, into the big picture mode, look at my settings. Hopefully you guys have the same settings or if you don't, you change it and your, your controller works on your PC for Red Dead Redemption 2. So what we're gonna do, open Steam, boom. View, big picture mode. It's gonna open up. And this is the updated big picture mode for Steam. So once we get in here, we're gonna click on Red Dead Redemption 2. We're going to go to the Manage tab. We'll go to Properties. We're going to go to Controller. As you can see right here, Xbox Controller Enabled Per Game Override. So if you go up here to the top, it says Controller General Settings. If you click on that, it's going to open up this, this right here. And I'm going to have to move my face because you can't see where it's enabled. Okay, now that I'm down here, you can see right above me, there's enable Steam input for Xbox controllers. I'm assuming you select this if you have PlayStation or whatever else you're using. So I have this selected. Everything works. I haven't had to do anything. You can go to begin test. And as you can see, I'll use the left joystick since my face is covering the right. You can see I'm moving it around. You see it moving. You see the numbers over here. Everything's fine. Left trigger. You'll see the numbers popping up as I press the left trigger in. So everything's working fine. This is the only setting that I have on Big Picture Mode through Steam. Uh, there's nothing else that I've changed or done anything. This all carried over from my last video with the old Steam. So hopefully this is all you need to do to get it to work. Uh, if it doesn't, please let me know in the comments. I'll try to find uh, another method. As you can see, if you click on the controller icon right above my head, it's got everything right here. Official layout for Red Dead Redemption 2 gamepad. Everything works fine. We'll dive into Red Dead Redemption 2 now. I'll show you guys that it does work on PC. No issues whatsoever. Hopefully this video helped. I don't know. Maybe this is a general setting that everybody has. And this video is absolutely useless. If it is, like I said, please let me know in the comments. And we will work hard on finding a solution. Let's dive into Red Dead Redemption 2. Okay, so now as you can see, we are in Red Dead Redemption 2. Um, just flicked over to the KBM settings. You can see the QE... Z, L, enter, backspace. So I'm gonna move the controller now. As you can see, everything's as it should be. I'll hit A, we'll go into story mode. And everything should work as it's supposed to. Those are my settings. Uh, I, I'm assuming it saved it from the previous settings that I had on my last video before the update to the uh, big picture mode in Steam. Uh, hopefully this helped. If it did, please drop a like. Maybe subscribe. I don't know. It's up to you guys. I don't know. It's up to you. Anyways, uh, let's get this thing running. We should be uh, we should be good to go. As soon as this thing loads, I'll take a nap in the meantime while we wait for all these screens to come into focus. Okay, there we are. Okay, here we are. We're in the game. Um, okay, why to use water pump? Boom, there we go. Yeah, so everything's everything's the way it should be. The controller's working. Hopefully these settings helped out. Um, I know a lot of you guys have reached out to me uh, wanting to know how to do it with the updated uh, Steam big picture mode. And everything looks like it should be working. Go back to the settings that I had just showed you. Uh, if you guys have any other issues, put it in the comments and I'll do my best to find the answers. Until next time. Appreciate you guys. Have a blessed one.